Welcome back to my channel. So this might have been a video that you have all been waiting for. Maybe not. Hopefully it doesn't really disappoint you. But I'm finally doing a makeup haul. I feel like these have been few and far between lately. And I know you guys miss them. But I just haven't been buying a lot of stuff lately. I've been trying to use stuff that I have or that I have accumulated over the past like many years. Because I have a lot of makeup. So trying not to you know, buy a ton of makeup this year, if that makes sense. And if you're new here, I would love it if you would hit that subscribe button below. I upload every Sunday and Wednesday. So let's get started. This is kind of a mixed bag. It's only gonna be like, it doesn't seem like a lot of things. But yeah, a couple things I purchased from Beautylish. So the first thing I picked up was the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Parisian Lights. And this is a limited edition collab with a French beauty blogger. I believe she's a French beauty blogger. So this product is not available at Sephora in North America, but it is in France and uh, Europe, I believe. So this is Parisian Lights. It is super pretty. I have not used it yet because I've been waiting to take pictures and haul it and everything like that. So that's what it looks like. It's a really pretty, like, just like a peachy peachy champagne I want to say like almost like a peachy champagne color it's really really pretty it's not like any of the Becca highlights that I have to be honest so maybe the closest one I would say if you have a lot of Becca highlights the closest one to this would probably be peach Bellini but yeah that's what it looks like super pretty I really like this color and I can't wait to be using this I think this is gonna be a really good product for the summertime just because it has that golden sheen to it and yeah the packaging is really really pretty so the next thing i picked up from beautylish was this a huge box right here i actually bought these two together because i wanted free shipping i actually just wanted to buy this but in order to get free shipping you have to spend a certain amount so i picked up this because i wanted it for the longest time i was really indecisive on the color but i ended up with the hot pink one and it's just jeffree stars star mirror so that's my camera <laughs> so yeah it's really really pretty i believe this was sorry this was probably like 35 becca's really expensive so i think that was 35 and this was like around 25 or 20 20 something sorry i don't have exact prices but it was a while ago when i picked this up it was the beginning of uh march i believe so yeah that's what the mirror looks like i just think it's so pretty i just love this it's just so extra and when you're doing your makeup i feel like this is going to be really good for when i'm doing makeup tutorials and stuff like that and like i don't know it's just a really big handheld mirror and i really like that because i have a lot of like the tiny handheld mirrors but not one this huge so yeah i'm really excited to be using this <laughs> because it's just been in its packaging so that's what the packaging looks like it comes in this really nice uh, smushy like styrofoam pink styrofoam so that's that uh, from let's go with my Korean beauty stuff next I picked up two things from Korea I have been really super annoyed lately with ordering from Korea I love Korean makeup but I just feel like the shipping is really hit and miss sometimes I will get my products sometimes I won't and it's really annoying because when you wait like two to three months for something and it doesn't come and you know it's one of your products that you use every day then it's kind of annoying you know so one of my powders i actually ordered back in january so i really need to message the seller because i haven't gotten it and it's already april so you know that's been an issue lately with ordering from korea but i took the plunge and ordered from this collection i only ordered two things but this is from the industry snoopy collection if you guys know me in real life you know that i love snoopy i love anything snoopy i love snoopy more than i love hello kitty stuff if you can believe it and i have a lot of hello kitties in my background but i love snoopy so i got the innisfree powder um i don't know what this is called it's all, it's all in korean but uh this is the basically like my innisfree mask it's the juju jiju volcano volcano ash extract in here or something like that 
but yeah anyways this is supposed to be a really really good translucent powder so I'm actually really excited to be trying this out because I wanted to try it for a while and it's in cute packaging now for this collection so I really like that and I'm glad they didn't like try to reformulate it or anything to be specific to this collection but yeah I also got the lip tint in I don't know what the name is I think it's number three lip tint in number three it's kind of like a darker deeper burgundy color and just the packaging the packaging is so freaking cute like it's like the valentine's day snoopy i really really like that uh the next couple things i got were from covergirl and this is from the Katy perry collection i bought this because of the packaging i'm sorry but i'm not sorry <laughs> It's just so cute. It was on sale at Superstore for $6.99 each, I believe, and they're regularly, I think, closer to $10.99 or $11. So I got the color Kitty Karma and the color Catnip, and I just, I think the packaging is just so pretty. I don't know if I'm going to actually end up using these because when I swatched them, they were really thick and kind of like sticky, but you know, that could always change on the lips. I'm not too sure, but... Yeah, so I got those two. The next couple things I got were also drugstore. The next thing I got was these Ardell Faux Mink Lashes. I wore these the other day, um, and mm, I had to trim the edges because when I was wearing them, I was really just annoyed the whole day because they were just poking me in my inner corners because there wasn't any lashes in the corner, but the band was just like super long. But I think that the next time I use these, they'll be, they'll be better, so. Those are those they're so pretty they like seriously just look like you know the super expensive mink lashes or if i got eyelash extensions or something like that i, believe I got these at walmart for like 9.99 and the very last thing i picked up was this eos marine collection and this is their mermaid lip balm once i saw this on instagram i just instantly wanted this and i tried to hunt it down for a while but I couldn't find it and it was actually in the toothpaste aisle at Walmart and I can't get it out of the packaging. Can't get it out of the packaging. So this is what they look like. Yeah, so I found these in a weird aisle. I found these in the toothbrush aisle and um, oh, they smell so good. I can smell it without, without even opening it. <laughs> so this one is really pretty. It has like that design on it and it has like an iridescent rainbowy background it's really really cute and the inside ooh, it's like really really pretty it's like a lavendery color I don't know it's so pretty kind of smells a little bit like their peppermint one but mixed with like marshmallow or something sweet and then this one they both smell the same oh this is more minty this is like a herbally mint smell and it's just you know their normal us ball oh that smells so good yeah i just really wanted these because i think they're really cute and i collect these us lip balms so yeah that's pretty much it for my haul i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys in my next video don't forget to hit the subscribe button below i upload every sunday and wednesday thank you guys so much for watching bye and lately I do bitches the meanest Tell them I love them and don't ever mean it We go on dates, I send a maid back out the neighborhoods and never seen it That shit is dangerous but it's